Okay, hey there. I wanted to show you how you can set up and run a Google Hangout. So the first thing that you need to make sure that you have is a Google Plus account associated with your Gmail. And that's the easiest way. So just make sure that you have a Gmail account. And once you're in your Gmail, just go ahead and click here and click on Google Plus. So you need to initiate the Hangout from Google Plus. I'm just going to it's always asking you to do something. Manage my page. Okay, so once you're in here, then over here under dashboard, you can come over here under hangouts. And once you are in a hangout, then uh, on the hangouts page, I mean, then um, is where you get started. Now, there's two things that you can do. You can start a hangout right away and you can schedule it. Now, the important thing is that you have two audiences for your Hangout. The first one is the people who are going to be watching the Hangout and not participants, meaning they won't be on camera at the bottom of the Hangout. And then there are the participants. Now, when you start a Hangout, if you schedule it, it's going to give you a link. Now, you can send out that link to anybody, and that is a viewer link. So that's when you, when you schedule it. You don't actually get a participant link, meaning somebody who's going to show up until you actually start the Hangout. So let's just walk through that for a minute. So when you come in here, you, after you clicked on Hangouts, come over here to start a Hangout on air. And you're going to give it a name, and I'm just going to say test. Um, how about let's do um, show starting Hangout. Okay, now I'm going to do one that starts later. So let's say I'm doing one Right now it's 619 and I'm going to say it starts at 630. So I'm going to go ahead and click here on um, here on later and we'll do a 630 a.m. And you can set your duration here. Now your audience is public and I would just leave it at that because remember that when you are setting this up, it is a public hangout and it's going to give you a link. So I'm just going to go ahead and click here on share. Now it's going to go ahead and on your Google Plus page, it's going to show you your Hangout. Now here, okay, now a couple of things. When you are on your um, Hangout page, notice that right over here, there's something called links. And if you click on links, then your event page is right here. So let's say that you set this up for later tonight and you want to invite people to the Hangout and give them the link. You'll send that event page link out and that's going to allow them to come and view your Hangout at the time that it starts. If they come before that, they're just going to get this page that says the Hangout has not started yet. All right, so that's the event page, and that's the link that you send out and say, hey, I'm having a hangout at 6.30. Here's the link. Please come and join us, okay? Now, you don't do anything with the participants at this, I mean, the people, the panelists at this point, because it's just set up and waiting. So you go ahead and send out that link to people so they know where to join you. Now, once you start your hangout, I'm going to go ahead and click on Start. Then you go ahead and you'll see here that when you do this, it's going to ask you to invite guests. Now, these guests are the people that you want to invite via email. So I'm going to go ahead and put in my other email address. Okay, and it's going to say send an email to suert 9254 at gmail.com. And then I can add more people. Now, remember that these are your participants, okay? And your Hangout is connected to your Google Plus page, and it's going to be broadcasted on there and on my YouTube account. And then I just click on Invite. Okay, I'm going to turn the camera off. All right, so now I have the Hangout is um, getting started. Now, what has happened now is that uh, SUR 9254 has been sent a link. You'll see here at the bottom of the Hangout, it says off air. Okay, so the email has gone out and um, to the people that you want to have on the panel. So when you did that invite, it'll send them a link. They can click on that link and they'll start to join you over here. And then once you're ready, you'll do a start broadcast. So that's going to be what starts the broadcast, what enables the, anybody on your Google Plus page 
which is over here. And anybody who has that direct link that you did when you first set it up um, can access the viewer hangout. And then um, once you're done, then you go ahead and click on stop broadcast and it will save it directly to your YouTube channel that you have set up with associated with your email account. Okay, just a couple other things to note. You can set up a chat so that people can participate in the chat. That's a new feature here on Google+. This is how you do a screen share. You just click on that, and I suggest that you do a um, desktop screen share. And that's the easiest way to, um, to get that going. The other thing here is the uh, toolbox. And here on the toolbox, this is where you can set your name. So I would want to put my name here, something like um, Scott Ewart, and then whatever you want your tagline to be, um, the traffic guy, something like that. Okay, and then just turn that on, and that will get your um, your name um, in that bar underneath. And you can um, use that then to identify all the participants. Make sure that if you're running the Hangout that you have your participants um, setting that up to do that. Okay, so just to recap you can set up a Google Hangout in advance or to start right now. When you first set it up, the link that it gives you is what you set to participants. When you come in here under your Google Plus page and click start, then that's when you send out the, you invite people to actually be participants and they'll get a separate link in their email to click on to join you as a participant. And then once you're in, you do a start broadcast and that will um, get you going. Okay, so if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach out to me and I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.